Welcome back to another episode of Caribbean Dreams TV. I'm your host, Maurice John, Mr. Property. And where are we right now? We're in Queens Drive, and we're about to get hype, hype, hype. Why? Because I have an amazing five bedroom house to show you. And trust me, this house, I love it. The area is nice, close to town, nice five bedroom property. It has a downstairs floor that you could earn income from. We're gonna go inside and I'm going to show you why you should be calling 492-6128 to book an appointment to see this property to get it off the market. So let's head into the property. So as you step into the house, you might not notice, but these are things that you need to notice. We have right here, a bar area that doubles as the kitchen counter. So the bar area is for entertainment. Now, where are we? We're in the living space. So this is a living room that comfortably seats quite a bit of people. Some things to note when you enter the living room. One, we have a suspended ceiling. Two, nice wooden floors. Three, there's an AC unit and several fans to keep the house nice and cool. All right, so beautiful living space. Excellent for persons who want to have a big open space to entertain people. All right, let's head further into the house. All right, so coming out of the living space, you're gonna be entering into the dining space. Now for me, I have a lot of houses that are built without a proper dining space. So it kind of a hindrance when you have families. I know all these days, everybody grab the food and go in the quarters, it's hard to get. Parents, it's hard to, parents are having a hard time getting their kids to come to the dinner table to eat, but it is really nice to have a dining space. So check out the dining space and see that you have a comfortable space for your family to eat. All right, so now we're in the kitchen space. You have enough space in here to operate and you have your countertops, lovely countertops, granite countertops. You have your overhead cabinets and you have your cabinets to the, on the, the lower section. So you have ample space for storage of your pots, your plates, your pans, everything. And you also have a nice comfortable space to operate when it comes to your cooking. So, lovely, nice kitchen space. Have a look. So now we're in the TV room. Now, some people like to separate their living space from where they go and watch TV. And this previous owner did that separation. So this room is for when you want to sit back, relax, watch some TV. So this is your TV space. This is the Utility side of the house, you have in this room a uh, laundry space and everything is in here that you need. You have your washing sink, you all have two pipes there for your washing machine and it is comfortably spaced that you can operate in this laundry area. Behind me is a washroom space. Uh, if you have guests over and you don't want to send them into your sleeping side of the house, you can send them to this washroom that is right on the utility side of the house so that they could use the washroom on this side. All right, so I'm standing in the carport. It accommodates one vehicle and you could see 
it has a lifted gate that is automated so you can secure your vehicles if you buy an expensive vehicle and you want to secure it you have a nice area that you can put your vehicle keep it away from the elements and also keep it safe from being stolen but that doesn't happen in St. Vincent at all so you don't have to worry <laughs> all right so we're heading over into the living quarters of the house all right so this room is presently used as an office space but of course that is because the previous owners or ageable people that didn't need an extra bedroom but this space is carpeted you have the suspended ceiling which is all across of the all across the house ac unit all across the house so everything is reflected here and they're using it as an office space right now but it can be easily converted into another bedroom all right so now we're into our second bedroom the first one is an office but really and truly i don't know not everyone might want an office but they might change it into a bedroom so it's maybe first bedroom for some but second bedroom for somebody else this is another big nice bedroom um could fit a double bed carpeted floors you have your ac unit well lighted you have everything that you need for a comfortable bedroom space so what you're looking at now is the general washroom that is shared um, for the two bedrooms there is also for the second bedroom that we just came out of there is a door that takes you from that bedroom into the washroom so it has a jack and jill setup where the person who occupies this bedroom could easily pop into the washroom we are in the master bedroom now big spacious wonderful you have again the carpeted floors you have a suspended ceiling with some really nice lighting setting the atmosphere the mood to get things popping and it could accommodate a double bed it has an ensuite washroom as you can see you have your washroom there again every room in the house has a walk-in AC unit so you could keep cool and bonus each of them has a fan too all right so i've showed you the top floor of this wonderful property but we need to get some details down for one i showed you the garage space and that garage space has a nice driveway outside i could fit another vehicle and we're gonna be seeing some more driveway space that you could fit even more vehicles uh, and also the property is completely fenced where we're going now we're going on the ground floor and that is a two bedroom apartment unit completely cut off from the top floor if you want to earn some rental income you can rent out that space it is again a seed out again you could earn a bit between 12 to 1500 dollars according to your rent out too so you could earn some passive income from that space downstairs also we gotta talk about the neighborhood we always talk about protecting your property value and one of the things about protecting your property value is making sure that you choose a good community that you could foresee is heading upwards or maintaining a trajectory upwards now of course land always appreciates the appreciation of land is directly related to what is around it land is not going to appreciate if you have a loud disco next door or you have a rum shop it, people not, this is not going to be attractive when it comes to if a property ever goes back on the market these things are going to kill your property value where we are now we're in queen's drive queen's drive is one of those residential areas that are right at the top right at the top with the cane garden and the rattan mill and how many hot up and coming but queen's drive is where you have the higher income earning persons living and that of course is good for your property value why that's good for your property value because these people because they have a high income earning they maintain the property so you won't have a rundown house everywhere you turn that in itself increases your property value so when you're making a decision to buy a property in queen's drive you're making a good decision to secure your property value in the future all right so i'm gonna take you downstairs to show you the two bedroom unit and you're gonna call 492-6128 to make an appointment to see this property and buy it. Let's go. We're heading down to the downstairs unit and if you look here, 
there is a gated entry for the downstairs. That means that the tenants that are staying downstairs will have their own entry. And if you look on this side, you're going to see an area where those tenants could park their vehicles, which of course, again, is a benefit and a plus for you. Because when a tenant is buying, they're thinking, okay, if I have a vehicle and Queen's Drive, Vandal Run in Queen's Drive. So people renting in Queen's Drive are more than likely they're gonna have their own transportation. And if you have your own transportation, you don't want them parking on the outside. So having an area that accommodates, you could fit about five vehicles right on this side of the property. That is an asset for you when you're trying to rent your units on the ground floor. All right, so we're on the ground floor. This is a two bedroom unit apartment and I'm standing right here. And there's a reason why I'm standing here because I turn on the AC and I'm getting the, you know, when you, yeah, I don't know if you ever watch um, the TV show with Sheldon, um, Big Bang Theory, when Sheldon positioned his chair right in the perfect spot to catch the draft from the breeze and the this and the that, and he calculated it perfectly. I'm standing right where the AC could hit me so I could feel the beautiful AC, all right? So down here, we have an open space. You have the kitchen space, the living space, the dining space, and there's even a space right behind here for the washroom. There are two bedrooms, and what is beautiful about those two bedrooms, each of those bedrooms have their own washroom. What does that do for you as a potential homeowner that could rent out these spaces? You could actually rent them out to people who don't actually live together, like medical students. Well, not family per se. So there are a lot of medical students right close by to Queens Drive. And I see a lot of those medical students buying vehicles and looking for apartments where they could drive to. So you could rent out one unit to one student, another unit to another student, and each of them have their own washroom space that they don't have to, you know, mix that part of their rental experience. Again, opportunity for you. So if you buy this property, you have that selling point for when you're looking for potential tenants. All right, folks, so I've taken you all around this property with the drone shots, with the inside shots, with the outside shots. You know how this property is inside out. What is the price of this property? This property is only $650,000 and you're getting a lot for that $650,000. You're getting a lovely neighborhood that increases your property value. You're getting a two unit apartment on the ground floor, adding income to your pocket. You're, at, you're getting a lovely space of top floor, AC all around. What am I forgetting? I'm forgetting that there are camera system. There's a security system all through the home. Also, there are burger bars all through the house also. And behind me is a lovely garden space, lovely backyard. You could come, plop a chair, relax, and enjoy the afternoon as the sun sets. What more do you want? You have to call 492-6128 book an appointment to come and see this property and let's get this property sold. We need to have somebody in this house, loving this house, appreciating this house. Don't forget to call me. Mr. Property, we out, we hype, we out, and we hype, we out, we hype, we out, we outside.